Technology always draws on the experience gained from our past. In 1995, while scuba diving, Lino Dionese had an intuition, a revelation, to set the bar up in terms of safety in the world of motorcycle racing. His thinking developed into the idea of an airbag for motorcycle riders. From the first prototype placed inside the helmet in the early 2000s, the project soon evolved into the first intelligent clothing, a fully active safety device. Thanks to the continuous improvements achieved by a research team made of engineers, riders, and safety professionals, together with the collaboration of several doctors, in 2006 the first D-Air activation took place with a stunt test at the Adria circuit. Then, in 2007, the first D-Air deployment in the racing world occurred at the Valencia GP, first with Marco Simoncelli and Simone Grotsky immediately after him. But that was just the beginning. In the following years, Dianese kept on working in two different directions. On one hand, it was about fine-tuning and upgrading the components, both in terms of electronics, such as improving the system's ability to recognize the danger and the activation time, and in terms of the gas generators inflating the airbag. On the other hand, it was about rebuilding the concept of the bag, moving it from the outside to the inside of the suit. Meanwhile, the street version of the D-Air was being developed. From the experience gathered on the track, here comes a device developed for road use, with the first D-Air street product debuting on the consumer market in March 2012. A year later, the exceptional performance of the D-Air street gets recognized by the prestigious German Automobile Club, ADAC. But not only that, having passed more than 800 tests, the D-Air became the first and only airbag in the world certified by TUV-SUD, one of the most prestigious certification bodies in Europe. Nowadays, the DNA Z D-Air remains the reference point for both racing and street markets. Besides winning the Ferdinand Porsche Award, partnerships with Ducati for the Multistrada 1200S D-Air and Yamaha and Peugeot have been established. In 2015, D-Air became a proper open platform the D-Armor is launched, an undersuit that uses the D-Air technology and makes it usable for all riders, even those not officially endorsed by Dianese. But the best is yet to come. The most important goal is indeed achieved in the same year with the first 1,000 deployments. Starting from that first idea of a helmet with an airbag, great energy has been invested. The new D-Air Mizano 1000 leather jacket embodies all the knowledge and experience gained in 20 years working on motorcyclists' electronic airbags. The future is in D-Air.